Hey everyone, kept the cucumber here, and I'm back with our Minecraft video to show you a medieval house tour. Not a tutorial, but a tour. I did a did a two of these. This is the second version I made. And I thought I'd show you around. Like I'm, there's this well right here. I think it's a nice addition to it. But I, in my pathways, I like to use coarse dirt and pod soil. They go really well together. And I think because I like using pods because it looks like dead leaves. But uh, we got a little lumber, a little lumber mill right here. Unlike the other lumber mill, lumber mill that I showcased like, a few hours ago, we have a house that we can explore. But uh, we're gonna check out the farm area that I made. See, I like putting just like little. I just like randomly placing the seeds around. I like I threw some red beets too. But over here we have a campfire. Thought it looked like a nice addition. It it like there's some things that just look bland to me and that really that really brings some light. Literally and figuratively. Let's take a look inside. So on the inside we got giant windows. I like to use giant windows. Well, especially two block high ones with some stained glass. But, um, we got a table, a little kitchen area with some storage, more storage up there. I they really look like cabinets. We got a bed over here with some storage, uh, uh bleh, with some storage next to it with some bookshelves. Those bookshelves actually really lighten up the place, figuratively, obviously. We got a back door that leads outside the pathway that goes to our lumber mill. Again. And there's a little tower up top that uh, spews out leaves. I like I like making those, those look really good. We got a little wood pile. Some wood we cut. And we got uh, a, blech, a log pile. And I think this would be a nice addition to a medieval town. Like a, a little lumber mill farm type of thing. <laughs> I, I don't know. But, um, I hope you enjoyed the video. We got a tree here, too. And subscribe if you want to see some more tours, or if you want to see some tutorials of how to make these. And, uh, leave a like. And comment down below what you think. And... Toodles!